in the last episode we looked into the different types of yarn today we are going to be looking into each of these types in detail first up is the wool yarn so wool yarn is said to be one of the first yarn types and wool translates to an archer's bow pullar kootu todutha maral podi narambin villiyal isaikum viraliyeri kurinji palgar paravai kilai seethu orkum pullar vilam pulam pogi this is an extract from perumbana trapadai it talks about the origin of the first yarn in the middle of a dense forest a group of people sitting around a campfire are in the process of making a choral instrument which is basically a wind instrument to play the palai pad but they are unable to get the exact sound so they move on to taking a branch from a kumilam tree and bending it over and this is tied using treated kattara fiber and it is said that this is how the first yarn originated wool yarn is said to be the basic and initial form of the yarn and it was created amongst a community of hunters in the middle of a forest even though the event is described in detail the location is not specified next up is the seri yarn it is one of the frequently mentioned yarn types in the sangha lekyam songs and it's been mentioned around 25 times we know this through kalaiwani ma'am's book sangha lekyatin isai seri translates to small and as the name suggests seri yarn is very small and compact it was used by a group of traveling musicians who went around telling their stories through music and it was specifically designed to be very compact and to be easily carried around in certain instances seri yarn is also referred to as kaiviri yarn kaiviri marungi sevvehi panni There are also instances where comparison is drawn between seri yarn and sengoti yarn. They are told to be the same as they both have seven strings. Specifically in the yarn nul, it is mentioned as being two different instruments, whereas in certain other texts it is considered as the same. In Siru Panatra Padai, seri yarn is mentioned having five different parts. They are kodu. patter tivavu poorvai and narambu next on the list is sagoda yarn sagoda yarn has 14 strings and it plays two octaves in sangha ilakya songs sagoda yarn is sometimes referred to as kelvi here is an extract from a song that talks about the sagoda yarn eeredu todutha sammurai kelvi This talks about how the sagoda yarn has two sets of seven strings and hence plays two octaves. Finally, we are going to be talking about the peri yarn. Peri means something big, and as the name suggests, peri yarn is the biggest of the yarn types. It generally has twenty-one or more strings. It is also referred to as paravai yarn and perungalam in Sivaga Sindhamani. And peri yarn is mentioned. four times in various sangha lekyam this again we know through kalaiwani ma'am's sangha lekyatin isai nul and there are various parts in the peri yarn that includes patthar paruvai pachai poorvai aani tivavu maruppu yaappu undi pannirambu kavai kadai kankundu Peri yarn is said to be the most technologically advanced of all the other yarn types during that period.